Uh, well, welcome back to tuning into today's video. We're going to do the five day forecast today, as we do every Wednesday. Have a detailed look at where the next five days across the British Isles. We're going to be seeing a lot of high pressure influences again, so it's going to be mainly dry. Orientation will change a little bit though, so I think we'll turn a little bit more unsettling cool up in the north and west over the weekend. Now, before I get on with the video, I just want to talk about the advertisement this video as on my page is at gasworthies.com. If you press play on the video, I should be sporting gasworthies.com. And uh, thanks very much for doing that. Um, the content ads, you uh, just click through the links if you're interested in any of the articles. Uh, you'll be able to go to the website where the article is and uh, read uh, the article. At the same time, Gasworthies will get a royalty fee on what you're doing. Thanks so much uh, for doing these things and supporting uh, the website. Now, the charts we're using are coming from uh, webcentral.d and weatheroutlook.com. You'll find the link to both of those uh, websites on my links page. At this point, I would usually be uh, also using the radar picture from the UK Met Office, but there's nothing to see. It's a universally dry day across the whole of the country today, so uh, we won't bother with the radar picture. We'll just get on uh, with the forecast. So this is today's synoptic pressure chart with high pressure sitting over the British Isles, uh, a very nice area of high pressure. There. Now, I've got a lot of cloud underneath it this morning, or we've had a lot of cloud underneath it this morning with some uh, mist and fog patches around as well. Most of that's going to burn off through the course of uh, the day, so there'll be some good sunny spells coming through this afternoon. Here and there, we could keep some low cloud and some fog uh, mist patches perhaps going uh, through into the afternoon. But I think most places will brighten up with sunny spells coming through. Now, depending on how long the fog lasts, it's going to limit the uh, the temperature uh, potential so if the cloud and uh, fog goes on for some time into the day then you're only going to get up to around 10 11 12 degrees when the sun comes out otherwise if you've had sunshine from the word go you're probably going to see the temperatures getting up to 16 maybe 17 degrees that's 63 uh, fahrenheit so quite a big temperature contrast across the country today between those areas that keep cloud for much of the day and those areas that have sunshine uh, or have had sunshine from the word go overnight we'll probably see more of that mist and low cloud and some fog patches coming back but also have clear spells as well under this area of high pressure uh, it's going to get quite chilly again tonight with rural locations having a frost temperatures going down to freezing maybe minus one even in the towns and cities we're probably down to two or three degrees which is low enough uh, for some ground frost so certainly quite a coolish sort of start to uh, Thursday morning but Thursday will really be a repeat performance of today though you will bring a very weak weather front into the north of Scotland so I think central northern Scotland will have more cloud maybe a few showers but most parts will start off uh, on a sort of greyish sort of note and then it'll quickly brighten up with good sunny spells uh, developing probably going to brighten up quicker uh, than it is the case today for most places as a result it could be a little bit warmer tomorrow with temperatures perhaps popping up to 18 degrees that is uh, 64 to 65 Fahrenheit so uh, a very warm day uh, for the time of uh, the year good sunny spells away from central northern Scotland. Now as we go through to Friday, the orientation of the high pressure is shifting a little bit, it's going off towards the west of the country basically just means that we're going to turn a little bit more and settle for Scotland we'll bring a band of cloud and rain down into uh, Scotland through the course of Friday, that may come down in towards Northern Ireland by the end of the uh, day. England and Wales again, probably a grey start, but sun's soon uh, breaking through with good sunny spells in the afternoon. Warm in the south temperatures up to 17 or 18 degrees cooler in the north though temperatures for scotland probably dipping down to around eight or nine Moving through to Saturday, the high pressure still down to the southwest, just off the coast of Ireland. Again, we're pulling the winds in from the northwest around the top of that high pressure. It'll be a cooler day all round, I think, on the Saturday. Rather a lot of cloud, especially in the morning. Some sunny spells coming through in the afternoon, particularly for England and Wales. Probably keeping rather a lot of cloud for Scotland, North Line and North England through much of the day. Temperatures, as I say, will be cooler all round. So in the south, probably seeing maximums of around 14 degrees sometimes. Like that, 57 Fahrenheit. In the north, probably just uh, six or seven uh, for northern Scotland. Southern Scotland, northern probably around nine or ten. But you'll feel the change, I think, in the air mass with that uh, northwesterly flow. As we move through to Sunday, the high pressure is bridging back in, if anything, to the south. So England and Wales stays dry. Uh, morning way of sunshine on Sunday, but it is the case on Saturday. It'll be a warmer day as well. We're cutting off that northwesterly supply uh, for the south. So temperatures will be lifting up across England and Wales again on Sunday, bringing back to 16 degrees, 61 Fahrenheit. For Scotland and Northern Ireland and parts of northwest England, it will be a cloudy day. 
not much rain around, a few showers, little drizzly bits and pieces, but rather a lot of cloud in the north as a result. Temperatures are limited to around 9, 10 or 11. And then we uh, end the forecast period on Monday, still with the same sort of situation, high pressure down to the southwest, probably bringing another more active weather system through to central northern Scotland. So I think, uh, again, for Scotland, we could have some outbreaks of rain on Monday. So that could be quite persistent and heavy, but further south, mainly dry. Best of the sunshine will be in the south and the southwest. That's where the highest temperatures will be, perhaps up to 17 or 18 degrees uh, once again. So it really is a completely dry uh, five-day forecast for England and Wales, uh, but there will be some rain at times in the north, but not a lot. Uh, even in the north, it's not going to be too bad. Here's uh, the charts from the weather outlook. This situation today, I've had a lot of cloud this morning, but I think most of that will burn off this afternoon. If they good to it's going to be a warm day as well. For uh, Thursday, again, mainly dry, cloudy start with maybe some mist and fog, but it should soon go, probably go quicker than is the case today uh, with sunny spells coming through and warm as well. Rain coming into the north on Friday, that'll move southwards, but peaks around on Friday night. Still warming myself, but turning cooler in the north. Sadly, a cool a day all round, rather a lot of cloud, best of sunshine being the south and the southwest, always cloudier in the north and northwest, where there could be some spots of rain around. Uh, the temperatures lift up again though for uh, Sunday across England and Wales with the sunshine uh, really coming back, always cloudier and cooler with some showery bits and pieces possible in the north. And then, as we go through to Monday, the end of the five-day forecast period, with more rain coming back into central northern Scotland, the rest of the country mainly dry, uh, good sunny spells, and it will be warm as well so in summary well if you like dry weather and uh, spring like conditions it's really good news for you high pressure is going to be dominating for the next five days will be some rain at times coming into the north but not a lot uh, mainly light and showery but basically high pressure in control particularly for england and wales uh, where it'll be basically dry fine and warm so a very nice five day period five day uh, forecast period coming up that's it for now enjoy it bye for now